police will install security cameras on traffic lights around Phnom Penh to identify traffic violators. The authorities will visit the homes of traffic offenders to impose fines. The traffic police will install security cameras on traffic lights around the capital to make it easier to identify and impose fines on traffic violators. By next year, the authorities will visit the homes of traffic offenders to impose fines. Ti Long, the deputy director of the Department of Traffic Police and Public Order, at the General Commissariat of National Police told the Post on Wednesday that traffic police are strengthening enforcement of the law with the help of technology. A two-day training course starting December 24 will be held to educate traffic enforcers on vehicle data management system and the effective implementation of traffic regulations through the assistance of security cameras. Once we navigate through this technology call system, we will begin implementing measures to impose fines on traffic offenders. So people must obey the law and be vigilant. Don't wait until the police show up at your home and issue you a ticket. Hum Yan, Deputy Chief of National Police and Secretary General of the National Road Safety Committee, asked the people to pay more attention when driving and follow traffic lights and traffic regulations. We are equipping traffic lights with cameras and installing a data management system by recording all activities on the road, including the plate numbers of vehicles. We will identify violators through their registration at the Ministries of Public Works and Transport, said Long. Yan said on Wednesday that to ensure enforcement of traffic laws, there must be a technical training course for traffic police officers ahead of the changes so work can proceed smoothly. We are committed to implementing this plan, although it won't produce any results now. Our officers need to be trained first to ensure its successful implementation. Senior advisor to the Coalition for Road Safety, Lâm Sok Chia, supported the continued efforts of the authorities to strengthen traffic law enforcement, which he said was important to reduce the number of traffic accidents. Asia Injury Prevention AIP Foundation Director Kim Panya also expressed support for the initiative. However, he said to reduce the number of traffic accident victims, more measures should be taken. What we are implementing can only be done in the city. But a large number of accidents happen along national roads. So if we install security cameras along national roads, it would be better, he said. Panya said that civil society organizations had called for transparency and fairness in the use of security cameras. Fines must be imposed equally regardless of the type of vehicles and identity of the offender involved. A report by the General Commissariat of the National Police said that as of October this year, 3,453 traffic accidents were recorded, an increase of 761 cases from last year. Of the figure, 1,665 people were killed and 5,212 injured, an increase of 151 and 1,006 victims from last year respectively.